सो हे गाइस वेलकम बैक टू माय चैनल फॉर ट्यूटोरियल्स सो गाइस टुडे आई विल टीच यू हाउ टू क्रिएट न्यू स्टाइल ऑफ बाउंसिंग बॉल एनिमेशन एंड सेकंड वन आई यूज हेयर सिमुलेशन So guys, select all assets and press delete key. And now, I go to on here, add and take plane. Guys, plane size this one. Plane size I like twenty five. All twenty five. Yes. Okay. So guys, next one, I use UV sphere this one. And guys, I change mesh this one segment. Guys, half like sixteen and ring I like eight. Yeah. and guys increase scale size also scale size like 4 4 good okay so guys go to on here and use wireframe like this yes and guys select this pair and go to up yeah right okay so next one guys i apply subdivision surface on pair so go to on here and use subdivision surface yes and increase viewport like 3 and 3 is good and right click shader smooth yes right okay so guys see that's my simple objects and next one guys i apply some effect i create bouncing ball animation so go on here yeah and guys apply soft body tag on sphere and select this plane and apply collision yes and guys go to back and play okay see guys that's not animate so guys select this pair and go to on soft body guys go to object also guys see that's my goal and goal uncheck and go to back and play yeah see guys that's my soft body animation simple right okay so now guys go to edge And see, guys, that's my blend option. I like ten. And again, go to back and play. Yes, see, guys, that's really bouncing effect, right? Okay. So now, guys, I change some more settings. So go to simulation, guys. See, that's my friction. Friction, I like zero and mass zero point one. Yes. So go to back and play. Yeah. See guys, that's my bouncing effect. See, it's really good. Okay, so guys, now I increase frames. So see guys, that's my bouncing frames. I like five hundred. Yeah. So go to back and again play. Yes. See guys, that's my beautiful bouncing effect. So guys, end frame same five hundred. Yes, it's good. So see guys, that's my first animation, bouncing animation, and now I apply hair simulation on this pair. So guys, select this pair, select this pair, and now guys go to on hair particle and select this particle. Yes, and go to hair and add one check. Yes, so guys, and go to source, emit from volume. Yes, and hair dynamic check. See guys, that's my hair dynamic, and go to back and play. So closer, yes. See guys, that's really good, right? Okay, so now guys, I increase more segments. So segments, I like eight, and length, I like guys two is good, yes. And guys, quality five is good. So collision, I like same five. So structure, guys. Vector mass, I like zero point one, and volume. Volume is good. So go to same catch, guys. And I like same five hundred, and go to vector is good, and rotation is good. 
guys physics yeah all is there so go to render and guys see that's my path so b is plan check and step i like six for more smoothness yeah see guys that's my really cool smoothness here yeah good okay so guys next one go to here children and use this one interpolate it yeah and display amount i like 20 yeah good see guys that's my hair simulation is good so go to back and play yes much better right see that's really good okay so now guys i increase some more settings so go to part tracing is good go to clumping guys clumping little bit in you little bit little bit yes and go to roughness guys that's my end point i like 0 0.1 and random 0 0.1 yes so go to king and nothing is good okay so guys that's it so go to back and play yes so guys that's my final one that's my final bouncing effect with using hair simulation yes and now guys i apply material so go to back and now i apply material so go to shading guys go to on here and guys create new material so first of all guys i use color ramp so press shift a and color ramp and apply on this one base color so guys select this color ramp select first checker box that's a black one and use pink colors so color code is 0 0.94 and S I like 0 0.91 and V I like 0 0.9 yes that's my pink color and second one guys select your first checkbox and select this color guys color code is 0 0.08 and S I like 0 0.6 and yes good so guys position also change position first one 0 0.114 yes and second one Guys, position 0 0.28 yes see guys that's my simple color and now guys i use select and use musgrave texture and apply on vector face yes and guys wave texture yes and connect with this one and last one guys select this wave texture press ctrl t yeah see guys that's my simple color codes and now guys i change this one scale size like minus 0 0.1 this one minus 0 0.1 and detail i like increase like 15 yes and guys go to here i use ring yeah it's good and guys see that's my scale size scale size i change guys like half 2.5 yeah it's good see guys that's my new style of wave texture and yeah all is good it's good see guys that's my new style of material right okay so guys select this plane and create new material guys simple base color i like blue and roughness 0 0.35 yes right see guys that's really good and go to again layout so go to on here and go to back and play yes it's good see guys that's my simulation and now guys last one i apply collision effect on spare so select this pair and use collider this one yes simple that's it so go to again back and play yeah it's good right okay so guys see that's my new style of simulation effect it's really good so stop this animation and guys i apply hdri image so go to here environment texture and guys i have some file 
select this one and open yes and now guys i apply background so select this plane and copy so rotate rotate 90 degree yeah and go to back like this and guys one more time copy and rotate same 90 and go to back yeah so guys select both objects so go to on up like this yes beautiful guys see that's my new style of simulation and go to on here yes and guys now i apply lighting so for light go to on here i use area light so guys that's my top light yeah top light and increase by size so size i like 5 and power i like 50 is good yes right okay so guys duplicate this light and go to on down and rotate this light rotate 90 degree yeah 90 yes and one more time i select your light this one top light and again duplicate that's my side light go to light down and again rotate yes and 90 yeah see guys that's my lighting and guys i take camera camera and set your camera angle so shortcut command is control or and press zero yes see guys that's my camera frame and guys you can change also camera setting so go to on back like this and little bit down yes so go to back and play yeah see guys that's my simulation it's really good yeah see guys that's my bouncing effect so stop this animation and guys go to render setting use cycle and use gpu and guys render sam i like guys fast rendering i like 1 to 8 otherwise you can take only 64 so 64 yes and create render preview yeah see guys that's my beautiful hair simulation guys it's take little bit time for rendering because my graphic card is not so much heavy so close and guys go to back so set your camera angle so go to up yeah and close off okay so guys see that's my final effect it's really beautiful and guys also you can create rotation animation is dependent on your work that's my rotation actually select and select this pair and that's my rotation animation this one you can also create rotation animation so go to zero zero and zero frame guys go to on here select all and guys go to 500 frames 500 and also 720 720 yes and select all keyframes yeah and go to back and play yes see guys that's my waving texture right okay so guys my final effect is finished that's my beautiful hair simulation and last one bouncing effect okay so guys that's it my final effect is finished so if you like my video please share and subscribe my youtube channel thank you